guys, Miss Charlie here with the Timu haul. Um, I discovered this app, just like a lot of people have from Instagram, and I've ordered several things from them. This is like my third order from them. Well, third and fourth, because this is an order, and then smaller bag here is also an order. Um, and I do have a lot of things in my cart. And this app is very addictive. It's kind of like Wish, but I've never purchased anything from Wish. My brother buys stuff from Wish. But I wanted to try them out. I bought a couple pairs of gym shoes from them, which I really, really enjoy. And a few other things, which I will show you at the end of the video. I'll show you clips of other things that I've purchased. I've had no issues with anything that I've bought from them so far. Um, but I'm gonna, I just wanted to show you what I got in my current order. Um, Cause one of the items that was in there, they sent me a message and they will bombard you with emails. So if you don't like text messages and emails and things like that, they will bombard you with that, um, with different deals and discounts and codes and percentage off and all this stuff like that. I don't mind it. I just look at them and if it's something that pertains to me, I erase it or whatever. But there was a pair of, of sandals that I had in my cart and they told me that they were now 81 or 71% off. So I got them for $3 and change when they were like 13 or between 13 and 15 bucks. So that was pretty good. So that made me go ahead and just get whatever was in my cart which is this order and then I have a bunch of other stuff in my cart that I'm going to I'm going to purchase um, in the next uh, week or so and some of those items have also come down in price so put things in your cart if you don't want them right now they will let you know if there's a discount on them because it'll put that discount in your cart so when you do buy it you get that discount so check out this um, check out this app I'll leave the link below but let's go ahead and see what I got in this haul. So I'm going to start with the smaller bag here that I got and it's just three nail products. I do my own nails and I also have a nail channel so if you need some nail art inspiration I will link it below. I haven't posted on that channel in years and most of the, the, the art on there is hand painted nails with acrylic paint and regular nail polish but I do my nails in gel now so I need to get back to posting but it's, 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 it's a lot <laughs> it's a lot but a lot of the stuff that I ordered is nail related like these are pigments that I'm gonna use on my nails and I wanted some pigments and I'll put I'll put links to all of the items that I that I got in the description box and again the prices have probably changed about 10,000 times because um, their prices go up and down all the time or they're sold out or whatnot I also got some spider gel I got the black spider gel this is also drawing gel so you can draw things on your nails with gel it's just a little bit more um, viscous than regular gel polish so it'll stay in place so I got the black and I am going to order the white it is in my cart and then I got some glue to hold rhinestones because I'm very hard on my hands. I use my hands quite a lot and rhinestones don't usually stay. I haven't found anything that's gonna, that really makes them stay on my nails. So I'm going to try this and see if it will work. But those were the three things that I got in my small package. In my larger package, I already opened this and I've already tried it. This is one of those washable lint rollers. It's a lot bigger than I thought it was. And I have used it and it worked just fine. But after you use it, you have to wash it. You can see it's wet because I did have to wash it. But yes, you just wash it off and you use warm water. I found that out. I tried using cold water, but the stuff wouldn't come off. So I used warmer water or hot water. And it did come off so this is a nice thing especially if you have pets and we have cats and dog cats and dog so this comes in handy and it comes in a little case here so if you need to you know lint roll and you don't want to use the paper ones which I do use as well I find that this one you can use it once but then you have to wash it and it's wet and you got to try to dry it off or wait till it dries and then try to use it again so 
I preferably like the paper ones, but this one is good in a pinch. So I got the, the um, washable lip roller. These are the sandals that I was telling you about that went on sale for like $3 and something. And I haven't opened these yet or tried them on. These are eight and a half. And they're very cute. Very cute. This, this part here is like, it feels like styrofoam, but like a hard styrofoam. So it's, it's kind of, it's, it's kind of sturdy. I don't wear a lot of sandals, but I, if I want to wear some, I like to just have a couple and just something simple like this. So these were really, really cute and they came in different colors and I will try them on and see how they, they fit and wear and I'll put a picture of me wearing them so you can see how they look on my feet. I got this pair of tennis shoes because I thought they were cute because they're jeans. Little jeans tennis shoes and they have like the little distressed top and then they just say denim. 101 on the side or it is upside down just so you know it's upside down this is but that's fine it's printed upside down but that's okay you're seeing it right side it's it's upside down but that's okay and then this is what the tongue looks like right there but yeah they have the inside it's nice it's it's firm enough it's not like too too flimsy and these are again an eight and a half and they had different colors but I liked the blue denim so I will try these and see how they work and again I'll put a picture of them and link them below if you are interested getting through some of these larger things this I thought was a little bit bigger but I can still use it this is to go in front of the, the uh, cat litter box um, because we do have like a little mat for them to step on but sometimes it moves around or it, it and it and it doesn't catch it doesn't catch the the litter so when they step out you know it's still there and then you don't have to sweep it this has little holes in it little recesses in it so that when they step out the cat litter is going to go down into those little recesses and then you can just and then you open it up here and then you can just pour it out so I thought that was really really cute and they had two sizes I thought this one was um, a little bit bigger but it will still work in front of their cat box but I thought this was really nice and it feels it feels like a, a styrofoam but it's not the kind of styrofoam that change it's gonna change its shape plus they don't weigh that much it's not gonna you know push it down but I thought that was really nice to have and it'll be a lot easier and cleaner instead of the cat litter just sitting on top of the the thing that we have now it's going to go down in the little recesses and then you can then you can open it up and just empty it out so i got this for the kitties for my car this is the armrest you know that you have in between you know the seats where you keep all your stuff at well, right now I have a towel on it. I keep a towel on it so that I don't, you know, rub it and it gets dirty because the inside of my car is a lighter color, even though I do have black uh, leather covers, but I don't have one on the on the arm thing. And, and it's it's like a, um, a brownish gray. So I have a towel on it. So when I put my arm on and stuff, it doesn't rub and it's not going to get dirty. So I saw these and I thought this would be nice to have. And it kind of, it'll match my inside a little bit because it's black leather. This is black and red, but that's fine. And then you just slide it on your, on your thing in between your seats. And that just keeps it, that from getting dirty, especially if, again, if it's light colored, it'll keep it from getting dirty. So I got this. I got this for me in my husband's bathroom. This is one of those dispensing toothbrush things. You put your tooth, toothpaste, toothbrush, toothpaste up here. And it's got the sticky, you can stick it on the wall. 
and then you put your toothbrush in here and this little lever pushes back and then it will distribute the toothpaste onto your toothbrush. I thought that was really, really cool. I've seen them, I've seen them for years, but never thought to get one. So, and Timu is one of those apps where you get stuff that you didn't think you needed, but you, you know, so this is from me and my husband's bathroom. So this is, I love how it says toothpaste because you put toothpaste here, but this is really neat. So I'm looking forward to using this. I got this little dumpling maker because we make our own pop stickers and they do take a while to make by hand. So this will come in handy so that I can put my little dough in there, fill it, and then just, and that'll crimp it for me. You can use this for, for that, or you can also use it for like empanadas and things like that. This would be great for that. So I am so happy to use this. I cannot wait till I make pop stickers again. So I'm gonna use this, and when I make some uh, empanadas, this is gonna be a game changer. Some more things for my nails. I got a nail stamper. I have a couple of them and it doesn't hurt to have more and the clear ones so you can see exactly what you're doing. So it's the little nail stamper there. Because that's what I have on my nails. These are stamped. I don't know if it'll let you see it. Come on camera. Ooh, there we go. These are stamped on top of gel polish nail stamp. So I got me another little nail stamper and it also came with a little card so that when you stamp it and you scrape the polish off and then use the stamper on your nail, on your stamping plate. So that, I got that. And then I have been into nail decals. The last nails that I did, I did like butterflies and flowers with nail decals. I found some other ones here. These are like scary ones, Halloween ones. Can't wait to use these here. Then I got these really cool ones here with the different black and white stars. And these are just like iridescent shapes. And then I got these here, just like the sun and moon, and they're silver. So yeah, so I got these things for, oops, for my nails. I got one of these things for the for our train and me and my husband's bathroom. This is one of those things that you put down in the drain for hair. It'll catch the hair and then you just pull it out and then you can clean it off and you know keep using it. It'll keep that hair from getting down in your pipes and clogging it up. And we have one in there now, but I need to get it. I wanted to get another one, so I'm gonna try this one. The one that we have in there now is a little bit harder plastic than this, and this is like really flimsy, but I think it will still work. And I like that it has a little handle so you can take it out but they came in different colors so I'm gonna try this in our sink I got one of these to clean the heads on the stove if you have a gas stove you got to clean those heads and things so they will ignite because they will get a uh, build up so I got this Oop. I guess that's that's just a long one there I have to clip that but it's got two sides so that you can clean those out and then it also has this little piece here so that you can get in there and get that build up out of there so I thought this was really cute to clean the um, if you have a gas stove I got these hooks to go on the back of the uh, car seat on you these hook onto your headrest so you can hang bags so you can hang your purse you can hang your book bag, you can hang your groceries, 
on the back of your on the back of your seat so this would go around the headrest and hang down and then you have a hook so that you can hang things you know groceries or whatnot if you don't want to put them on the seat or hang your bag or whatnot so I got two of those and that'll come in handy for when we go grocery shopping I mean you can put it in the back because I have an SUV but sometimes I just want things to hang there so they don't get you know jostled around like eggs things like that you know um, very fragile things so you can hang them on the back um, so they don't get messed up or broken so I have those two hooks I got this little hair remover thingy this is what you put I believe you put it in your dryer or your washer one of those and it gets the hair the pet hair off your clothes and it's sticky they had them in different colors and this one has a kitty on it since we have kitties so I'm gonna try this and see how it works I mean hair comes off of our clothes pretty well in the washer and dryer but sometimes you do get those stubborn ones so I'm gonna see if this works to get off any extra hair I got some of this stuff here that you can put on the back of your car if you have like a um, I have an SUV so when you open up your tr your your hatchback you can put this down on the um, the back of your car to help for any scratches or anything like that so I got this and it's pretty long so you can do several um, layers or you know if your lip is wide on the back of your your car you can do this with a regular car too on the you know the trunk the bottom of the trunk so things don't get scratched or whatnot when you're taking things in and out of the trunk so and this is really nice and it's really really soft and my tr my truck is black so I got this so it'll it'll match somewhat but I kind of like this so that you can put it back there and help prevent any scratches and then lastly I got this little cord organizer thing for my work desk because I need to redo my work desk because I work from home and I need to redo my cords so this has like three little holes in it and you can just you can see that you can open it up and then put your cords in there so they can come through and then you can stick it on the back of your desk or under your desk so you can organize it and this comes in um, different sizes so you can get one with three holes five holes I think there's one more that's bigger than this but I'm just gonna I just got the three hole one but I thought this was really cool for organizing your cords for your desk all right so those were some things that I just picked up from Timu um, again I still have a lot of things in my cart um, a couple of them have come down in price but if they come down in the next week or so then I'm gonna just go ahead and get that order so when you find things on Timu put it in your cart and if it does come down in price they will send you an email or a text to let you know that that price is now come down and it will change that price while the item is in your cart so you can take advantage of it so again if you don't like emails if you don't like a ton of texts they will bombard you they will bombard you but I don't mind but some of those texts are saving you money they're helping to save you money on something that might be ten dollars and they might have a discount and it might end up being three dollars or five dollars so if you don't mind that go ahead and sign up for Timu it's free just get the app um, but let me know if you've tried this site what things you've gotten and I will show you some of the other things that I purchased from Timu as well thanks so much for watching I appreciate you all have a great rest of your day um, make sure you like, share, and subscribe, and we will see you in the next video.